Hello, Pepe Cavalieri, joined by Gary Turner to preview this weekend's uh, footy in the WRFL. We'll get straight into Division 3, obviously, round 11 getting underway this weekend. Smackers, Tarnead and Laverton first up. Yeah, uh, this will be a good game. Uh, Laverton uh, nearly got a, a win last week. They're building along, but uh, I can't see uh, Tarnead dropping this one at uh, home. Yeah. And North Sunshine's taking on the might of Parkside, who will want to bounce back. Yeah, North uh, Sunshine have uh, just fell over the line the last couple of weeks, but good sides do that. And, uh, yeah, they're going to hopefully cop the full run of uh, Parkside that uh, I reckon uh, Nick would give them a rocket uh, this week and uh, they should be too strong. Well, hopefully not for North Sunshine they cop it. I don't think they'll like that at all. Uh, Wyndham Suns full of confidence against Sunshine Heights. Yeah, they uh, flag favourites now, aren't they, after toppling uh, Parkside on, on their home deck. And uh, they've got the, the forward line uh, of uh, all the big guys down there. Uh, they work well together and uh, they'll uh, be too strong. Sanctuary Lakes take on Braybrook. Your thoughts there? I think Sanctuary Lakes can win this game at, uh, on their home deck. Uh, the young kids, uh, Henderson and Bruce and so forth, are, are building nicely and uh, uh, with that. So, uh, yeah, I think that's uh, one game that they, they can win at uh, Shark Park. Around uh, nine in Division 2 sees Auburn Vale take on Newport Power. Yeah, big game this one, isn't it? Uh, if Newport Power want to uh, finish in the, f the finals, uh, they must win this game, and I think they will, uh, with uh, Henny Harp saying the inclusions of uh, nine or ten players, uh, I think they'll be too strong for the Cobras. West Footscray and Manor Lakes, a good opportunity again for the Roosters to see how far they've come this season. Yeah, uh, they have. Uh, they're building nicely, aren't they? But uh, I can't see them beating uh, the Storm. And our uh, match of the day on 88.9 Win FM is also the Love the Game, Not the Odds game, an initiative by the Victorian um, Responsible Gambling Foundation. So we, may, we need to make sure we give that a plug. The top of the table clash in Division 2, Smackers, Yarrable Seddon and North Footscray. Yeah, I'm not a gambling man, Pip, but uh, if I was, uh, my money would be on uh, North Footscray to win this. They're going along nicely. Responsibly, I hope, uh, Smackers. <laughs> need to take it easy. Here, we need to heed the message. Um, leading into this week, obviously. Um, Division 1, round 11, Deer Park and Spotty. That's the top of the table clash. That should be a beauty. Yeah, it should be a beauty. Uh, Spots with the only side to beat uh, Deer Park, but I think Deer Park will, will get one back here. Uh, Sunshine and Albion are fierce rivals. Uh, we've got the inside word from Albion there. I'm pretty excited, and they need to really turn around um, what was a poor performance last time the two sides met. Yeah, they do, but uh, I can't see uh, Sunshine dropping this one at their home ground. And another game with a lot on the line is Caroline Springs and Wyndham Vale. Uh, if Wyndham Vale can get up, um, you would think that's a big step towards them staying up in Divi 1 next season. Yeah, it is. But uh, Caroline Springs, uh, the last couple of weeks have been competitive. All depends on one bloke. If Lake plays, I think Caroline Springs win. All right. You heard it from the man. You have to make sure you uh, let Wyndham Vale into Caroline yeah. Springs first. <laughs> Where be districts and St Albans? Uh, Werribee Districts, uh, they can't afford to drop this and uh, on their home deck, uh, they'll be too strong. And another uh, big game, Hoppers Crossing and Altona, who are in the midst of a tricky uh, three-week block at the moment. It's really a, a very uh, important game for them. It is, and this will uh, be a really good uh, cracking game. I'm going to go Altona just because of their form uh, has been, I know they've, they've dropped uh, last week, but it's been consistent and uh, yeah, I think uh, there'll be an upset uh, with that one. All right, you heard it first from um, Gary Turner. Uh, we look forward to your company on Saturday afternoon for Yarraville, Seddon, Eagles and North Footscray. Uh, we're not sure where the game's going to be. Hopefully um, by Saturday we've uh, figured it out, but we'll be there. Make sure you tune in on Friday night as well. Listen to uh, Gary and Kev Hillier for the, uh, the preview show. Uh, until then, we'll see you soon.